Hello everyone, welcome back to Think and Derive. We have 1 by x plus 1 by y equal to 1 by 5. We will find its positive integral solutions. So let's start. In the first step, we will subtract 1 by y on both sides. So that will give us 1 by, 1 by x equal to 1 by 5 minus 1 by y. So that is 1 by x cross multiply this. So this is y minus 5 over 5 by. Now from this side we have 1 by x and from this side we have y minus 5 over 5 y. Now let us reciprocal on both sides. So this is x equal to 5 y over y minus 5. Let's make this equation number a. Now since y is positive integer, so for the x to be positive integer, this y must be greater or equal to this 5. That is, y must be greater than 5 or y must be greater or equal to 6. Because in case y is less than 5, this x will be negative integer. So, so we have y is greater or equal to 6. Let's make this equation number first. Now let's suppose x is greater or equal to y. That means 1 by x is less or equal to 1 by y. Now add 1 by y on both sides. That is 1 by x plus 1 by y is less or equal to 1 by y plus 1 by y that is 1 by x plus 1 by y is less or equal to 1 by y plus 1 by y is 2 by y and this 1 by x plus 1 by y this is from the question this is equal to 1 by 5 so that means 1 by 5 is less or equal to 2 by y Now cross multiply this, so we have y is less or equal to 5 to the 10, let us make this equation number second. Now from the equation first and second, we have y is greater or equal to 6, less or equal to 10, that is y is equal to 6, 7, 8. 9 10 so these are the values of y now we'll we'll put the values of y one by one in equation number a so first of all we'll put value 6 this 5 into 6 is 30 divided by 6 minus 5 is 1 so 30 by 1 is 30 so when y is equal to 6 x is equal to 30 and when we take y as 7, this is 5 into 7 is 35 and uh, the 7 minus 5 is 2, 35 by 2, that is not an integer. So, so we have no value of x for the value of 7. Similarly, when we take uh, y as 8, this will be again non-integer non and when we take 9, this will again be non-integer. And when we will take value of y as 10, this is 5 into 10 is 50 divided by 10 minus 5 is 5 and 50 over 5 that is 10 so we have two values here that is, first one is 30 comma 6 and second value is 10 comma 10 so we have only two positive integral solutions of the given problem hope you have understood this question thanks for watching and uh, don't forget to share it with your friends We'll see you in the next video till till then take care and bye bye.